Hello everyone, welcome to this channel and in this video I'm going to show you the continuation of my tutorial video about on how to create a login form in Microsoft Access with different security level. Because in my previous video, the part 2 of this tutorial, we only created two accounts, the admin and the user, which is the admin opens directly to admin control form and then the user account opens to dashboard. Let's try to open the dashboard using user. User1, that's the user account we have created. One, two, three. And here we go. As you can see, guys, so it opens directly to dashboard. And there are lots of tabs. But these tabs are handled by different departments like this one. The employee form. It should be open only by the HR department. And this one also, the settings, which should be opened by the admin only. And the rest, so other departments. So now, we have to assign these tabs to different departments. Like for example, if HR. So HR can only open this form only. The rest, they cannot able to open. If this one settings, so only the uh, IT or the admin can uh, access this button first thing to do we have to disable this okay except the logout and then no enabled no okay so disabled except the logout let's save and close and by the way um this is the security level I have created. So admin specific to admin control form only. We have done this one in my uh, part one. And then the maintenance team. This is the part three, uh, level three. And then the level five, which is the HR. You can open employee form only. So now let's start to make a code. Level 2. Again, the level 2 is can access to all. So, all we have to do, let's type this one. Let's copy paste that one. And then, let's open to dashboard. Okay, the name of this button is that one okay that enabled equals true and let's count one two three four five six seven eight nine so nine tabs I have to copy paste this one Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. So next is nine and eleven. So nine, eleven. Next, thirteen and fifteen. Thirteen, fifteen. Next, 17, 19. 17, 19. Next is 21 and 1 to 8. 21, 1 to 8. Okay, that's enough. And let's proceed to um, level 3, maintenance team. Not allowed in settings and employee list. So, let's copy-paste this one. Okay. And let's change this to 3. Not allowed. Employee number 15 and number 1 to 8. Sorry, sorry. Okay. 
I will delete this and number 15. Okay. That's it. I'll put next. It's copy paste five. Okay. Fifteen and thirteen. So let's put thirteen and fifteen. So now let's try. Let us close this one and also this one. Close and let's try to log in. Let's check first. Popoy, so that's um, for HR level 5. And Eduardo, this is uh, maintenance. And then user, admin 1. Okay, so let's try first to Popoy. We'll try this one, uh, Popoy and Eduardo. So Popoy first. And access granted okay here we go so since he is in HR department he can only open the employee form and the employee accountability form this one okay this one the rest disabled so let's try to open by another user Eduardo So, Eduardo can open uh, the rest of the tabs except employee and settings. This one. Okay. Okay. Reports. Material issuance. Change password. Okay. So, now let's try the admin. User 1. And here we go. So he can access to all. So that's all. I hope this video helps you a lot. And if you have some questions, you know what to do, just comment it down below. Once again, thank you and see you to my next video.